Welcome back to another video on the channel. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. So today we finally ended up getting the hammer and sickle melee weapon. This was something I was expecting to drop earlier in the Halloween event, but we got it with a day and seven hours left. But here's the melee weapon right here. You can't actually see the sickle. You can see at the bottom left where it says hammer and sickle, but for the actual preview, you can only see the hammer. It says dual wield melee, a powerful union between industrial and agricultural tools. Demonstrate the strength of labor with deadly melee attacks at close range. And how you actually unlock it is get a melee kill and a tomahawk kill or throwing knife kill in the same life in 15 different completed matches and overall that challenge is not hard at all it's just very time consuming but per usual i just ended up buying it through the bundle in the store the bundle is called the split personality bundle you get the melee weapon blueprint called the agony and ecstasy two antonov skins a watch a execution called the hook and hinder which is the exact same melee weapons that you do actually end up getting as well so it's the same thing as the hook and the sickle and then you also get the tea bag uh gesture and then a couple other cosmetic items when it comes to the stats of this melee weapon i'm not going to go through every single melee weapon the one that it compares to stats wise which you know from the bars at the bottom is the cane it's exactly identical but when you get into a game and you use the hammer and sickle you'll quickly realize that it's a three hit kill not a two hit kill and then even when players are downed it's also going to be a three hit kill and i mean that's six hits in order to kill a player that goes down that's at full health that is a lot of swings and that is a very high time to kill for a melee weapon but even though that's a little bit of a downfall when it comes to this melee weapon it was still a lot of fun to mess around and use today man it just felt badass to run around with them in your hands so i think i'm gonna give the melee weapon a solid seven out of ten obviously it would be lower if it wasn't as cool if it wasn't as cool i'd probably give it like a four or five out of ten and you guys can let me know down below in the comment section how you guys feel about it anyways i'm ready to show you guys the gameplay that i ended up getting with this new melee weapon hopefully you guys doing up enjoying it it was super chaotic at the beginning it slowed down and then got super chaotic at the end you guys should definitely enjoy it if you could drop me a like on today's video i would really appreciate that let's see if we can hit 7,000 likes on today's video also if you're brand new around here i'd really appreciate if you could drop me a sub and without further ado let's just go ahead and hop into the gameplay all right where are we landing today not feeling salt mines us too far away our spotted airport's got a buy station let's go ahead and land there we got a new melee weapon to check out and a new execution man should be a lot of fun today i was really hoping this would have dropped during the halloween event like during the main part of it before halloween but i guess better late than never right at least it was before vanguard dropped there's one that landed over here i'm not sure if one landed in this building or if they just landed close and went somewhere else it sounded mad close where the guy was hovering okay well at least cash isn't horrible we can definitely manage this and make this work let's see if we can get a little lucky in here though Ooh. okay wait who's shooting at me nope no sir whoa, whoa how did he not kill himself from falling down i thought if you fall off of that building you kill yourself that's so weird i'll take the bounty though okay well he's poached we already have enough for the loadout let's go i'm ready to check out this dual wheel melee bro i really am there we go we got it let's go ahead and hop in here and inspect this bad boy oh no right here right here oh wait he turned around bad decision oh it's a three hit kill what the heck i figured it'd be a two hit kill okay well it's a, a hammer and a sickle that's pretty sick dude just inspect it real quick that's pretty cool man yeah that's pretty cool let me know down below in the comment section how you guys feel about it i think it's badass it is a little buggy and weird whenever you put it away with your riot shield yeah like the sickle stays out a little bit longer than what you would like but that's to be expected with any new thing that drops in the game you gotta expect it to be bugged out all right well, let's hop in and uh, i guess we'll go for this bounty over here all right a guy over here at fire interesting He's got to be inside of here, bro. Oh, what? It hey, won't let me mantle that. Oh, whoa. How are you doing? Got him. That's not even our bounty. That was a different guy. Is he, is he all the way up top? Yeah, he is all the way up top. Unfortunate, dude. We do have two thermites to get him out of up top. Let's see. That's got to kill him. Come on, right? Kill him? No? Wow, he's lucky. Feel fighting in here. He killed him, right? Actually, I don't think he did. Nope, he's right here. Nope. 
Got him. Oh my god, it takes so long to kill people, bro. Oh, oh my god, dude. This thing takes forever to kill people. Yeah, so you're going to have to guarantee that you hit a good stun on somebody in order to take them out with this melee weapon. I'm not saying it's bad yet. I don't think it's horrible. Oh, somebody just pulled up and took the vehicle that we had. Oh, man. Well, that sucks. Once we get another thermite, I'm going to try and take this guy out of up top of here. Oh, whoa. How are you doing? Oh, come on. Come on, die. Why do you fuck? Oh, that boy was pissed. That was the decoy that was under us, right? Yeah. I mean, do I do this? Oh, whoa. How are you doing? He's stuck. I reset. Come around in this corner. Uh. Whoa. What's up with that? There's multiple. I'm playing this patient. One went to the left. He's in that building somewhere. This guy's right here beside us. He's executed. Here's the execution right here. Oh, it uses the melee weapons too. That's sick, dude. There's another one fairly close in this building, I'm pretty sure. Let's head over here and get this uh this bounty going though. I guess he could have came over here too, but nah, he he's over here somewhere though. We need to hit a buy station ASAP. Yep, there he is. Yes, sir, you're executed too. Man, we've actually got a lot of kills going this game. And then all you hear is the character saying, you fucked with the wrong guy. <laughs> uh, we really need to hit a buy station, bro. Self, UAV, munitions, and a spare. Okay, there's one down low over here. Let's go ahead and head for this guy then. Actually, it looks like he's heading this way. Whoa. What's up, brother? He's stuck. I just didn't want to get into a situation with the other guy. Okay, he's dead. There he is right there. Oh, no way. I stuck him. There's no way. All right, he's dead. Uh, let's go ahead and use this munitions box. We'll call in the UAV and then we'll we'll get another munitions going. There's a couple people flying in. I'm just not sure if they're gonna try and land their loot or not. Nope. Nope. Got him. Okay. Um Yeah, it's definitely gonna be beneficial for us to just get the hell out of here. So even if it's on foot, that's the best thing for us to do. Just go ahead and make a, a fast rotation here and not wait for the gas to come in. So far through my first game using these melee weapons, I feel like they're solid. They take a long time to kill, which is not the greatest. You know, three hits is not that great, especially when it's a dual wield melee weapon. I mean, with the sticks, with how fast they melee, that's good, right? But with these, I, I, I feel like it should be a two hit kill. Because six hits when a player does end up going down, I just feel like it's too much. But I will say the range and the, uh, the movement speed isn't horrible on it. Seems like it does have solid range. Oh, come on, dude. That man shot me. That was a good sniper shot, too. He cracked me good, dude. Hope I don't get hit again. I'm calling this UAV. Nothing. Wow, they're a little further out. Yeah, that guy was just cooling it over there. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, my. We just got so lucky, guys. Oh. I'm going to go and throw that down. And we'll get us some munitions going. All right, let's vibe for a second, kind of figure out what we want to do. I, I can't really remember where the other guy was because we just got into a fight with that dude. I was about to look at the mini map and see where he was. And, and usually when people camp in a house like that, the door is not 
open so i didn't expect anybody to be in there i'm just not really sure what i want to do here it's just so open and the fact that we don't have a vehicle to really get around like i could go and get that bounty but we don't have a vehicle to really get around here and i'm not taking a dirt bike i'm probably just gonna chill around here play it slow and just kind of figure out where the next circle is and we'll make our way into the circle if we need to all right let's see where this next circle is gonna go here i mean we're technically in it um I'm just not sure. Maybe going up here would be the best bet, being up there in that area. I'm going to call the UAV in and just see what's up. Okay, got up top. Just people camping in planes behind us. I don't know. I'm going to rotate at least down here to these houses to see if there's anybody chilling down here. All right, nobody was in these houses. Hmm. Maybe we can rotate over here. It's just one of those games that have been super slow because we haven't had a vehicle. Usually, if you have a vehicle, it just makes the game like a thousand times faster. Oh, nah. Take the munitions. I'm gonna make my way down. I don't think there's anybody here. Most of the people at this point. Oh my God, dude. Oh, we're screwed, dude. There's nothing I can do. If I try to throw my item, I'm gonna end up getting killed. oh i missed yeah there's not much i can do here guys i'm gonna have to just take some shots oh, okay all right well we made it out this is gonna be extremely difficult for us to rotate now unless we go like far right or something that's a good spot he has bro that's a really good spot to chill in maybe we can do a wide cross over this way and get lucky got him Ooh. man i was not expecting a dude to just be chilling in here like that i mean maybe we can get lucky and rotate in the gondola here i'm just gonna try it there's no other option here the only place we get shot from is up top or oh wow yeah i'm just gonna have to keep my my shield face this way We're going to have to tank our gas mask a little bit. Oh, oh, we didn't even take any damage. Wow. I just in general think that was the move there though, guys. Even though we don't have a gas mask anymore, I think that was the play. Yeah, that was definitely the play. Oh, and we got a gas mask. Nice. Sometimes you have a lot of action in Warzone, and then sometimes you got to play a strategical, like a chess match. And there's this guy right here. There he is. He must have seen me go in there. I think if we sit here, we could be good. You go on the outside of the wall? Where did he, where? Oh, down there, okay. dude no good no good where the hell did this guy go though probably drop down low Had to try it. I gotta rotate around this way. If I don't, I'm gonna end up getting killed. I'm 
I'm gonna tank it. This is crazy. Same guy from before. Let's go, baby. Executed for the dub. This is the same guy. <laughs> Definitely the same guy. G freaking G. 17 kills. It got pretty slow, but we definitely ended up clutching and making some really good rotations towards the end. Fourth quarter shot